all right let's be honest with ourselves pretty much narbrell hasn't been pretty much the most talked about character of this collab it's been pretty much being Demiurge because Demiurge had pretty much revived the Demon Team to be literally the most dominant team in PvP. Even though Narbro is actually a super fun character when you pair her alongside of other unknown characters because then again she'll give like a crazy attack boost to them, which is really fun in PvP. That's what I like about Narbro. She actually is a pretty fun character to play around with. Obviously not the best, but pretty fun. So we're gonna use a fun team featuring Fatoria and Green Elaine. This is going to be a one turn one shot combo as you got a lane paired alongside a Fatoria, one of the most high DPS unknown characters um, in the game. And again, a lane. Now, the crazy thing is that Elaine does have her holy relic that does increase shock damage uh, debuffs by 30% towards the enemy with damage dealt. So that means our damage is going to be actually really, really powerful because if you don't know, Nabrel does apply a shock grade debuff on the enemy. So paired alongside a lane, lowering the enemy defense and her holy relic. That means Fatoria is going to actually just one shot, one shot any teams in PvP, which is going to be actually crazy. Especially if you give her like the attack boost from lane, Fatoria is going to go crazy. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe again. And let's see what we can do. Uh, I'm very excited to try out this team and see the crazy damage. All right, what we got here? 393. Oh boy. Well, we about to do a lot of cooking, boys. Go for our shock debuff. Quick buff. And see what we can do. Ooh, really good damage. Let's see how much Vittoria gonna do. Uh, definitely not broken. Definitely not broken. Yep. GG. Well, that was, uh, exciting. All right, we got the Demiurge combo. I ain't gonna lie, I feel bad for my team. I feel bad for whoever, whoever got to face this in PvP. Because, like, literally you lose both Demiurge and Gelda. Only person who can really tank is Meliodas. If he has dupes. And he did not have dupes. Dang, he forfeit too fast for us. GG. All right, what we got here? A Thor team? Uh, could he be dodge food? Let's see. Like, I'm just going to use, like, like, I'm just do the same play <laughs> and see what happens. Oh, yeah, GG. Dang, 1.5 million. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot what Elaine's passive. She does increase the damage if they have like a shock debuff, huh? I forgot all about that passive. I guess if I see or feel like a team is using dodge food, I probably should like not attack buff with Elaine. Like, this guy is obviously not using dodge food because he's literally 400k, which means he has to be CC food. So we're going to AOE and this should get rid of at least Omnis, Nebula, Zeldris and Demiurge. Yep. It's because he most likely has like Kusak in the back to reduce his crit damage or reduce my crit damage. Yep. All right. Let's see this uh, unknown team. Ooh. We actually got a really lucky because I already know this guy is going to be dodge food. So we go for this. You're going to do this. And then we're going to AOE. I already know he's dodge food, but we're going to lower his crit defense even further. And we got a silver card. So this should one shot his store, which means he's going to forfeit right here. And he's a champ one too. Oh my God. He's been cooking players. See ya. Oh, now you got cooked. Go back in champ two that team go back in champ two all right we got boys 384 all right let's have some fun go for a shock debuff 
and then do this. So go for attack buff. Make sense my my shock. And instant death. Only 1.3 million. Yep, GG. All right, we got a Gelda. All right, more fun content. Let's go. Yo, I should just, I should just do something on the side, like watch, watch One Piece, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. So this is just infinite, just AOE spamming. What the world? How did he tank that? How did DK Melios tank that? Oh, this is gonna hurt. Elaine is dead. Whew, I'm actually surprised she lived. I swear, in my head, I'm like, yo, she is dead. I'm sitting here like, bro, ain't no way she's gonna be alive after this. All right, so we're going for this. Uh. I want to, uh, I guess I can go for this then. I low key, I mean, I just want to troll. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm gonna just use this and then do this. Cause I know this is probably going to one shot right here. Cause I got my queen strike on. Yeah, one million. And then this <sighs> did not one shot. Unfortunately, that'll look so cool. Like they give me so many opportunities just to use my my gold card. Hopefully Lane does not kill right here. I'm scared. I ain't allowed. I'm scared of Lane my kill right here. So I'm over here trying to troll. So let me just go for this. I just want to see the gold card, man. Again, I know it's like a minute where you might see the gold card. So I wanted the opportunity just to see it. See both my cards. 67k though. All right, GG. Again, I just wanted to see the damage. I just wanted to see it low key. All right, what we got here? Demiurge. Let's go. We'll go for shock and AOE, and that's it. Hopefully, this all works out. Yo, to live with a uh, loaded percentage of HP, probably because she has true awakening. And then we can just finish it off right here. Ouch. Ouch. That stung a little bit. All right. So this is where we just do this and this. Hopefully this one shots. I think it does. This is 1 million. Oh, 700K this time. And this is going to do decent damage right here. Yep. 149. It's just that because he didn't have the shock debuff on him. And then he deletes my card. Or one of them. But it's alright. Tori should finish it up. Finish it up right now. Yep, GG. Alright, we got boys. A Demiurge team. Do the simple shock. In AOE method. Again, this is a fun team. Like, it just does so much damage. It's freaking hilarious, too. <sighs> Gelda lived. That is a shocker. <laughs> Pun intended. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm such a troll. Like, yo, that's a shocker. Okay. And there goes AOE. 
Whew. Close. It's like 200k in terms of damage right there. Maybe I should try to go for like my, my silver card right here. Just so we can guarantee the kill. All right. And let's see. 1.2 million on a single target. What in the world? Ooh, we low-key can probably get um, Narborel, uh win image right here. Let's see. I think she should do like really good damage right here. Yep. If I had still the attack buff, it would have one shot. All right, let's go, baby. I'll take the win animation right there. All right, we got here a Sabnok Demiurge team. It actually is insane. Um, I guess you go for a shock debuff and an AoE. I wonder if this is going to kill, though. He does have a lot of red characters. Actually, yeah, this is going to kill. The way Sabnok took all that damage. Yep, 1.3 million. GG, my boy. Is he gonna keep playing? Cause you're, already, I'm gonna say it's GG regardless. All right, let's see, boys. Get me urge. I ain't gonna lie, this is gonna be my last match. <laughs> like this team is just fun, but obviously, like it's boring. It's a boring team. Cause all you're doing is just going for three setup cards and then you're just nuking. And if you face a dodge between, you're kind of like messed up because you can't do the setup. Because you need that shock debuff to deal extra damage. Because again, you're using a lane passive as well. So, yep. GG. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe again. Just really, guys, I'm out. Peace.